With that, it is my singular honor to introduce you to Sherman Alexi. He's a distinguished poet, novelist, performer, and filmmaker. He's published 25 books, including the best-selling The Absolute True Story of a Part-Time Indian, and wrote and co-produced the film Smoke Signals. Alexi grew up in Will Pinnett, Washington, on the Spokane Indian Reservation. We are so honored to have him here with us tonight. Please welcome Sherman Alexi. Thank you, Chris. I didn't know it was going to be Planned Parenthood comedy night. <laughs> I would have written more jokes that had choice as a pun. <laughs> You're great. When are you running for office? <laughs> she reminds me so much of my friend Polly, who's native, so she's like, the white Polly. <laughs> I didn't want to get out of bed this morning. I didn't sleep well last night. My iPad was within reach, though. <laughs> like all of us, our devices are within reach. And I checked my emails, and I had none from any friends. And I thought, shit, they're all depressed, too. <laughs> and I laughed. Because it was unlike election night and the couple days after, when every white liberal I know emailed me, called me, stopped me in the streets to apologize. <laughs> to express their shock. We brown folks are not shocked. So please stop saying that. <laughs> Please stop expressing your shock. They're your cousins who voted for it. <laughs> it's not our fault. We brown people voted against him in massive numbers. Gay people voted against him in massive numbers. We protected ourselves and one another, but you white folks did not. You failed. You did not do enough. So when my friends were calling me, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I was like, I have no fucking idea. I'm a writer. What did I do? On Wednesday morning after the election, I looked up, who's in charge of fundraising and public relations at Planned Parenthood? I went online. Who's in charge of fundraising and public relations at Planned Parenthood? Katie Rogers, oh, what's her phone number? Hey, Katie, this is Sherman Alexi. Uh, I wanna do something, anything, anything at all. Uh, fundraising, running, talking, 
fighting, mixed martial arts, <laughs> poems, and anything, 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 anything. And she called me and said, we're figuring it out. And then the amazing Planned Parenthood made it about all of these organizations, made this evening about all of us, made this evening about every... We are being holistic liberals tonight. <laughs> now, as a writer, I've had plenty of opportunities to write. As a famous writer, I've had even more opportunities to write for big magazines. They've emailed me and called me, Sherman, we need your response as the Indian writer. And I understand that as an artist, I can be spiritually beneficial to you. But I don't know what that does for actual political movement. So I'm here tonight as an artist with the people who are going to be doing the work. I will be reading with other writers too, don't get me wrong, but tonight, at this inauguration of the resistance. I wanted to celebrate the frontline workers and they're sitting over here and you will be hearing from them tonight about their organizations. And I repeat what Chris said, you wanna help in the biggest way? Cash, cash. <laughs> Cash, cash, cash.